So we want to use uh, linear approximations to estimate uh, square root of 8. Um, okay, so remember, step 1 is to find the uh, tangent line um, of the function. Now, uh, my function, since it's I'm looking for square root of 8, my function is going to be square root of x. And remember that if you're not given a point, you have to choose one. Um, and so uh, the idea is that you try to get as close to... Um, the value inside is possible, uh, making sure that it's a value that you kn know how to find. So, for example, um, for square root, near 8 that you can find is x equals 9. And so uh, we're going to find the tangent line of square root of x at x equals 9. Okay, so uh, we've done this many, many times. Uh, we find the derivative, which is 1 over 2 square root of x. And um, so the slope is f prime at 9. Notice how you're using always your easy point, the one that you know. And you don't plug in uh, 8, the point that you're looking for, until the very end once you have your line. So derivative at 9 is 1 over 2 square root of 9 which is uh, 1 sixth okay so then uh, we find the y-intercept so I have y equals to uh, mx plus b um, I find my slope which is 1 sixth sorry I plug in my slope my x value which is again 9 make sure you keep using the the 9 the value that you're um, that you're finding the tangent line for. And then the y value is simply 3. Remember, you get that by plugging 9 into your function. Okay, so if you do this, um, you get that b is equal to 3 uh, minus, here you have 9 times uh, 1 sixth, which is simply uh, 3 halves. And so 3 minus uh, 3 halves is just uh, 3 halves. So your uh, tangent line is y equals to um, 1 sixth x plus 3 halves. And then remember this is also called the uh, linearization of uh, f of x at x equals 9. And it's symbolized by capital L of x. But those are just symbols. It's basically the tangent line. So then um, we say that um, square root of 8 is approximately equal to plugging 8 into uh, this function right here, so the tangent line. So I have 1 6 times uh, 8 plus 3 halves, which is uh, 17 over 6 or also um, 2.8333333333333. Okay, so that's your approximation. Now to find the error, um, we need to find the actual value. So let me uh, close this off here. So this value right here, this is our approximated value. And then um, to find the error, which is actual minus the approximated um, is 2.8284 minus 2.833333 um, this is equal to uh, 0 0.0049. Okay, so that's the error. And then the uh, percent error, remember, is... So the percent error is equal to the um, error over the actual times 100%. Uh, okay, so then I've got 0 0.0049 over the actual, which is 2.8284 times 100, 
And that is equal to, drum roll please, 17.17, 17, 35%. Uh, so pretty close. And that's it.